Hello friends, let me introduce myself. I'm Chris from the French Gardening Channel, The Gardening Bible, which already has over 135,000 subscribers. That's why I'm starting a new English language channel to share the experience I've gained over the years of gardening with you. I will be translating all the videos already present on my French channel. However, since I'm not great at English, I'll be using artificial intelligence to help with the translations. So, it won't be my real voice that you'll hear. I hope you enjoy these videos as much as my French community does, and, most importantly, find them useful. If that's the case, don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and maybe even share my videos to encourage me to continue with these translations. Also, feel free to let me know in the comments if the artificial intelligence translations are accurate. Enjoy watching. In this video, we will see together how to propagate your strawberries through seeds and runners to regenerate your strawberry bed. 1. Before getting started. Plant selection. Choose healthy, vigorous, and productive strawberry plants as the source for propagation. Viruses are easily transmitted through this method of reproduction. They impact the production and size of the fruits. Good to know. Runners are only useful for the reproduction of strawberries. If you do not wish to multiply them, it is better to cut them as close to the base as possible, as they unnecessarily exhaust the plant. 2. Propagation through seeds. Propagation through seeds. In a tray, place 1 cm of gravel for drainage. Add 3 or 4 cm of seedling soil. Sow the seeds, cover them with 1 to 2 mm of sifted soil, compact, and spray with water. After 3 weeks, Transplant the young plants into small pots filled with seedling soil. Place the pots outside in a sheltered area and keep the soil moist. 3. Propagation through runners. Identify runners, slender stems, emerging from the mother plants. If you want new plants, remove the strawberries from the runners. During summer, Pull along a line of runners and identify the most developed one with roots and beautiful leaves. Keep it attached to the mother plant, plant it in a pot filled with soil, and secure it with an iron clip. Water the pot. Two weeks later, cut the runner at its base and replant it in the garden at its final location. For maintenance and additional tips. Remove secondary runners to promote the growth of main plants. Renew mother plants every two to three years to maintain vigor and prevent diseases. Avoid excessive propagation through runners as it may weaken the plants. Change the location of the strawberry bed to prevent soil-borne diseases. Ensure proper ventilation, and make sure plants receive an adequate amount of light. Following these steps will allow you to effectively propagate your strawberries and maintain a productive garden over the years. This video is now finished. Thank you for watching it until the end. I hope you enjoyed it, and, more importantly, that it was helpful to you. If that's the case, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give it a thumbs up to encourage me to continue translating all of my French videos. Also, feel free to let me know in the comments if the artificial intelligence translation is correct or not. See you soon, friends, for the next video. Goodbye.